Since we were just a few days away from The Force Awakens, I figured I would do another Force Awakens top 5 list all about this new movie that's going to be coming out. And in this one, I would like to talk about my top 5 most anticipated new characters. I am also extremely excited about the old cast returning yet again for another Star Wars movie, but like I said, this is a full new characters list, which I am also very excited about. I'd like to real quick give two honorable mentions, and these are two characters that I am very excited about as well, and I think that they will be awesome. So my first honorable mention is Maz Kanata. We hear a lot of her dialogue in the recent TV spots and trailers that we've seen for The Force Awakens, and I think that even if she doesn't play a particularly large role in the movie, it will be a very significant one. And my next honorable mention is Captain Phasma. I'm very excited to be seeing a chrome trooper on screen and I know that she's one of the main villains and one of the most heavily featured villains so far and I'm very excited to see what she does, what her mannerisms are, and overall I just think Gwendolyn Christie is great. So now that we're done with the honorable mentions, let's go ahead and get started with my number 5 pick. So my number 5 pick is General Hux. Now he's a character that we don't really know a lot about and I'm very interested to see, since he's so young, how he got to be such a prominent member and high ranking member of the First Order, even high enough to be able to directly interact with Supreme Leader Snoke. I just have a feeling that there's something special about him even if he doesn't turn out to be a force user, which I don't think he will. He seems to command a lot of respect from the soldiers that he's around, and like I said, as a high ranking member of the First Order, I think that there's got to be something going on there. At number 4 I have Finn. Now this is a character that we really probably know the most about, John Boyega, from the looks of the way he's acting in the trailers and the one clip that we've gotten to see of him. I think he's going to do a great job, he's going to absolutely kill it. I already really really like Finn and I'm interested to see his character arc from Stormtrooper to Resistance member to possible Jedi and I'm very excited to see his duel with Kylo Ren in particular. At this point, Finn really feels like he's the audience's eyes and ears, and that he's going to be a character that's thrown into this new universe, and I'm very excited to see that. He's also the character that's most frequently wielding a lightsaber besides Kylo Ren, and I'm very interested to see the details of number one, how he acquires that lightsaber, and number two, if he does actually turn out to be a force user and a possible future Jedi. At number 3 we have Rey, now this is a character that we also don't know a whole lot about, even though we've seen her a lot, I think that the most interesting part of Rey is her heritage and how exactly she learned to be skilled with that staff. I myself am pretty positive that Rey is a force user and most likely a future Jedi and I'm very excited to see her role in this new Star Wars universe and what she has to offer all of us. At number 2 I have Supreme Leader Snoke, now this is the character I've probably talked about the most on my channel. I'm very interested to see number 1 again who he is, and number 2 what are the extent of his abilities. We know he's a very vulnerable character, and a character that's also very powerful in the dark side of the force, and at this point, maybe besides Luke Skywalker, the biggest mystery in The Force Awakens, and Andy Serkis being one of my favorite actors, I think he's going to do a great job. And finally, my number one pick I think is fairly obvious, it's Kylo Ren. I'm very excited to see him. Adam Driver looks like he's going to do a great job. Adam Driver, even without the mask, it can be a very intimidating individual, and I think he has a lot of potential to be a great villain, and fingers crossed that he's a full trilogy villain and not just a one-off villain. He's also another character whose heritage I'm very interested to find out. I believe that he is the son of Han and Leia. I think that that's pretty obvious, at least for me, although they could throw us a curveball and it could surprise us all. I'm also interested to see the extent of his powers and how exactly he learned to use them and craft his new lightsaber, which is a weapon that is very, very interesting and something else that I can't wait to see. So anyway guys, thank you so much for watching, go ahead and leave in the comments your top 5 most anticipated new characters, may the force be with you, and have a great day.